Luca. 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 Okay, I made it to the pillow fight at Washington Square Park. This is um, the least crowded pillow fight I've ever seen here. Usually it's hundreds of people with pillows, and here it's like a dozen, that's it. Still pretty fun, but I'm surprised. Usually the whole square is filled with people and pillows and their feathers flying around, but today, maybe a dozen, maybe 20. The park is lovely, the fountain is working, there is uh, blooming trees everywhere. And everything's turning green. Yeah, that's the... There's too much going on in town, people cannot <laughs> decide where to go. They have too many options. But still, we do have a pillow fight here in Washington Square Park. That's escalated fast. Oh, he had enough. Some people take it very seriously. I think I have a pillow fight on my channel from 2016 and 2017. So you can check them out and see the difference between the two events. I am a little late, but I do not see feathers on the floor, so I don't think it was bigger like an hour ago. Oh, there's a big fight behind us. <laughs> so that's the pillow fight. I'm telling you, before the pandemic, we had a pillow fight, everything here, full with people. You could not move. You could not take a video of it without getting hit by a pillow. But um, somebody did say that the prices of pillows went up and it's like kind of expensive now. And they don't think there's going to be a big turnout for this event. I don't know if it's the price, but they were totally right. Okay, some blooming trees. The fountain is dripping water. Like, even if you go, like, I'm all the way here, and I can still feel the water hitting my face. Okay. 
some cherry blossoms since um, I didn't have the opportunity to show you a lot of blooming trees this year. Hey Kim, how are you? How's everything in North Carolina? I'm showing uh, all the beautiful flowers here at Washington Square Park and the greenery. It did turn out to be a beautiful, beautiful day. It was supposed to be raining and the parade was so much fun. Like two minutes after, after I stopped the live video, the dog group showed up. Unfortunately, they, they did not have the wolfhounds, but they had all the other Scottish hounds. They were so cute. Some of them have um, had um, some really nice outfits on them. I'll uh, edit the highlights and I'll share it with you. Also, we had Nessie coming, the Loch Ness Monster. She was also marching the parade. And then it was uh, more bands and groups. Um, pretty much the same idea as we saw during the live video. Um, but there were some uh, really nice moments there. I'll share it with you soon. I'm happy we got here to see the flowers and the beautiful day and all the people having fun. The park is very crowded. It's, oh, oh, there's a rainbow. Do you see the rainbow at the fountain? Um, the, the uh, Washington Square Park is always crowded on weekends on beautiful days. And today is no different. It, it's nice, it's not warm. Uh, yesterday it was hot, it was 30 degrees Celsius, like 87 degrees Fahrenheit. It was really hot. Um, and today is like 20 degrees Celsius, like 70, around 70 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's much better to be outside. It's, the heat yesterday was If you go midday, it was hard to be under the sun. But today is perfect. Absolutely perfect. And we're back to the pillow fight. More pillows, sorry. More pillows, more people. Whoa. I did see some feathers on the floor. I did. Anyway, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy I was able to cover it, both events today. And I'm going to go uh, back to Mika right now. So thank you guys so much for joining. I'm wishing you all a wonderful, wonderful weekend. And I'll see you very, very soon. Bye, guys.